Hey guys, what's going on today? Welcome back to my channel. Yes, I look like a hot mess and I probably look like some crap. But I just got out of the shower, I washed my hair. No, 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 no. And I wanted to put on a mask because I got these new face masks from Walmart. I know, don't judge. Don't, don't judge. But you guys don't know, I love crystals and everything. No. So I love crystals and I saw that Walmart has these gel um, face masks. It's Cosmic Holographic Peel Off Masks. It's hydrating amethyst. So they have like amethyst inside of it. So I'm really interested to see how it's going to go. Hey, I love peel off masks because I feel like I'm peeling off my beauty. Like all the ugliness and everything and the dust can tell about the same time. I'm not a big fan of peeling masks because they hurt really bad and I cry like a baby so look it's sticky <laughs> so you gotta leave it on for 10 to 15 minutes until it gets stiff and I just put it on and I record I will record myself peeling it off and then we'll come back outside and do first impressions because you can see better outside than it is in my bathroom I'll see you 10, 15 minutes. up guys so you just watched me painfully took my mask off look how my hair's drying it's slowly drying I'm not such a big mess I swear I am cute anyways um I have not put a cleanser on at all no face products nothing so this is what my face looks like after the, the painful <laughs> painful mask oh my gosh I don't know, my hair looks like crap right now. What? So this is what the mask looks like. Oh my god, it was so painful, I almost cried. I literally was tearing up though. Um, putting it on, it smelled like alcohol. Very perfuming and everything, so I wasn't sure how it was going to go with my skin. So I'll find out tomorrow, but my pores are open. I close it with water. He just feels like, it does feel soft. It really does, but at the same time, my face feels like I just ripped it off <laughs> because it's a peel off. Oh my gosh. It hurts so bad. My face is still tingling from it. Like you just peel a scab, you know, that tingling sensation. If you ever had a done peel off mask, you know what I'm talking about. So, this is not the type I don't think that will take pores where you can see your pore on it. Like your nose, like hairs, or like whiteheads if you can't if it is i don't i can't it's hard to see ignore my big scar is that my name of my scar is that the name of my scar yeah that's my scar right there i've had it for years it's like 2010. we'll do that another time my scars story um, you might be able to see like little hairs besides my knee on the mask. Wait, 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 wait. Let's see. Let's see. I can find where my nose is. On here. Oh, there's my, there's my nose, guys. It looks like it deformed alien or something, I don't know. Let's take a look. Uh, no. It's hard to tell. See? It's hard to tell. 
if you can really see it. But um, going on rice, it's like really thick, taking it out of the package too. So there's also that problem because it's so thick. And you will put a, you won't even need like to save the rice because usually with pill offs, not you always have enough to save for like to do two masks at a time. Because some people, I don't know how it works out, but somehow it always works out where you always wind up having two times for applications but this time you can only do one because of how thick it is um it went on nice but i just didn't care for the perfume smell of it the perfume alcohol smell so i was worried with my skin because i'm very sensitive so i was worried about it um it took about 10 minutes to stiffen up my face feels so sore i'm gonna have to put aloe on my face just to moisturize it and to get it from not like being so tingly so um i probably would try it again i got a, actually i do have two of them <laughs> i got an amethyst and i got a rose quartz so now maybe i'll try the rose quartz so let me give you a close up of my skin I did rinse it with water. I don't even know what this spot is, but I've had this for like three months now, this spot. So if you know what it is, please let me know so I know how to get rid of it. I've been in, accepting it as a beauty mark now. So I have this little red mark. It's not a scab. I don't know what's wrong with it. I've tried everything. Well, that's it for this review. Let me know in the comments below if you want me to do any more reviews on makeup or face products or anything. Just let me know. Thank you for liking my video and watching it. Have a good day and good night, guys. Peace, love, Korean heart. Bye.